Well, this is happening right now. A live look here at Swifty Mania. <laughs> it's happening at SoFi SkyCal over the parking lot at SoFi Stadium as Taylor Swift and her fans swarm in just minutes after the gates opened just a few minutes ago. Other fans have been lining up since before the sun came up <laughs> for the first of six sold out shows right here in Los Angeles. And KCAL News reporter Jasmine Veal is live at SoFi as it starts to fill up. And Jasmine, do you have any more friendship bracelets left? <laughs> I have been collecting these friendship Ooh. bracelets all day. I think I'm a true Swifty, but I, I, they're still not going to allow me to actually go see the concert. That's what I'm bummed out about. <laughs> so the gates are open. The show starts in an hour and a half. And I'm telling you, Inglewood has never seen so much sparkle, fringe, and glitter. And fans are so excited because Inglewood is no longer the last U.S. city on the tour. The 12-time Grammy winner announcing even more dates in the fall. It's day one. I can still make the whole place shimmer. Of Taylor Swift's six shows here at SoFi Stadium in her heiress tour. Taylor Swift! I have been counting down the minutes and the hours until this concert. Fans lined up hours prior, dressed in the pop star's image. I'm from her fearless tour in 2008, where she's dressed as Marching Band Taylor. This is the <laughs> lover's era, yes. so you have to get, like, heart everything. Exactly. Yeah, the earrings, the pink, head to toe. They bought more T-Swift merchandise. This is the, like the thing that everyone wants. This is a crew neck. Really? And exchanged <laughs> friendship bracelets. What do they all say? Lover. You want to trade friendship bracelets? Yes. That's what Swifties do. The heiress tour swept through the states this summer. Okay. This is her I went to your Seattle. Mm -hmm. I made an earthquake in Seattle. <laughs> One online research group, Question Pro, estimated that the U.S. leg will generate $5 billion in economic impact. Many people here paid hundreds of dollars for a single ticket. We're talking 500 a little more. 700? Around there. Per ticket. Something like that. Even thousands. The package was $8.99, and then you have to, and then plus like the actual seat, so it was about a thousand or like eleven hundred. Like but mom Jennifer Ralph says it's worth every penny for her daughter celebrating her 16th birthday, even named after the singer. We feel like this is like the soundtrack of her life. You know, I've I've sort of baptized her with Addison. Taylor yeah. Swift. The excitement grew outside the gates Thursday. Cause an earthquake tonight? Absolutely. <laughs> you gotta do better than Seattle. With these fans overjoyed, this is no longer her final set of shows in the U.S. I'm with Brett from Hawaii, about to head inside. All right, tell us about your shirt. Sure, it's from the 22 video. It says not a lot going on at the moment. Okay, I see you. you're a big fan. Yeah, we're ready to go. Okay, good luck. Have fun inside. Thanks, good luck getting in. Cheers. Follow the yeah, rules. Okay. <laughs> All the way from Hawaii because he says they don't have many concerts there. By the way, Taylor Swift making history here at SoFi Stadium with the most sold out shows of any artist. And think about this, Pat. More than 70,000 people capacity wow. here at SoFi every single one of these six nights. Mm, that's so <laughs> a lot of people, a lot of performances to come. Yeah. You know what, uh, Jasmine, I hope they're prepared for the parking situation there. Yeah. You know, because, I mean, it's kind of difficult to get out of SoFi when there's a game. But for something like this that's completely sold out, wow. Uh, absolutely. Parking sold out. You had to purchase that ahead of time. Metro hmm. laying out how they can take the Metro train to a certain station, K and C, and then get a free shuttle over here. They're also promoting ride shares. So I've seen yeah. a few party buses pull up with a ton of people getting off. Okay. Yeah, we're going to talk about that in a minute. And Jasmine, I just think we ought to try to get yep. you a ticket. You got to get a ticket. <laughs> Please. You've been Someone. doing great. And Someone. go live. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. All right, Jasmine. Phone. Well, if you don't have tickets yet, but you still want to see Taylor Swift tonight, there are some still available. Here's a live look at StubHub's seating chart. There are a few standing room only seats available for under $400. Okay. But if you want to sit up close, it will cost you thousands. One floor seat is listed for nearly $8,000. Hmm. Yeah, what about getting there? We touched upon this. How much does it cost to do ride share? We just checked from Studio City. Uber says it can get you there to SoFi for $37. Hmm. It would take over an hour, however, because all the traffic, of course. And Lyft, they can get you there for $58. The trip would also take over an hour because of all that traffic into SoFi Stadium.